sounds like this. Ooh, ooh. Is so iconic. What's up? You're watching Hive Mind, the most damp show on the internet. My name is Riley Zosim, joined by my cologne infused co host, Dignan. Smelling like a sweet little flower. Today we're stealing all the free samples at the farmer's market. This is Guess, Guess the popular, popular Rap Song from the Sample. We didn't see the other ones, this is how it's gonna work. DJ Grant's gonna play us a song or sound that has been sampled in a popular rap song. We're gonna have to guess which popular rap song that is. One point for each one we get right. Me versus Diggy versus you. Mikey Vasilatos from Akron, Ohio. I know LeBron says this in a cheeky way, but you really are just a kid from Akron. <laughs> all right, before we get into it, make sure you like the video, Subscribe if you want to see more, HiveMindTV.com for our merch. Also consider joining our Patreon. It's only $5 a month. You get the extra content and you get to play against us in the games like Mikey from Akron. Last thing before we get into the game, today's video is brought to you by our friends, Manscaped. Manscaped. I'll tell you a little bit more about Manscaped later in the video. I said last thing, but I lied. Today's game is a little bit different. So stay tuned for a twist about halfway through the video. <laughs> Oh yeah. That's beautiful. Beautiful stuff. That's one that's very iconic that I just, I don't know if I've ever heard the original. But what better place to start than this song? Right. You know what How I mean? How perfect. You kind of don't have a choice. Yep. Three, two, one. Good morning. Good Kanye morning. West. It is Good Morning by Kanye West. Oh yeah. It's good to start with a point. The original sample is Someone Saved My Life Tonight by Elton John. Oh, it's Elton John? That's an Elton John song. Elton John. Wow. How about that? Good morning. Beautiful sample work, a little pitched up Elton John. Kanye knows how to do it better than anyone else. What is that? Huh? It's coffee, Starbucks. Who's that on the cover? What? Who is that? It's just, it's just like a, their logo, I guess. It's like a mermaid woman. <laughs> Turn it away. What? Turn it away. Are you flirting with the <laughs> girl stop. on the Starbucks cup? Dude. Turn it away, just stop. I'm getting distracted. <laughs> what? <laughs> What the hell? She's so pretty. What? <laughs> you have a crush on the Starbucks logo? Stop, oh. dude. No, no, this is... You think I can get a word in after the video? You can talk to a cop after the video, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I know it, but I don't. And that's the f that's the tough part. Ah, ring, ding, ding. Dude, the other day I smoked so much weed that I threw up. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> Sick and twisted. Three, two, one. Mad City, Kendrick. President Carter. This is Backseat Freestyle by Kendrick. Mm. Ah, of course it is. Mm. Ah, ring, ding, ding. Ah, ring, ding, ding. In my yep. head I went, oh yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, My dick's as big as the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Have you seen the post in Kendrick's subreddit about <laughs> no. like breaking down the math of his dick being as big as the Eiffel Tower <laughs> and fucking the world? So it's like it's like saying like it would be technically very small if right. his dick was the Eiffel Tower fucking the world. Yeah. Because compared to the world, it's not very big. <laughs> people have so much time on their hands. <laughs> that was the caption. Somebody yeah. posted the screenshot and said people have way too much time on their hands. Like Kendrick, please drop an album. Like these people are desperate. <laughs> the world's like, is it in yet? <laughs> Sticks the Eiffel Tower in the Mariana Trench. <laughs> Don't forget to rub Mount Helen. <laughs> Sexy. She said, come into my wife? Come into my life, I oh, hope. Yeah. Uh, uh -huh. Okay. Stop cuck shaming. Yeah. That's what I will say. Yeah. Stop it. We need them. Stop cuck shaming. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Jesus. <laughs> my bad, brother. Three, two, one. I put P power. P power. It is P power by Gunna featuring Drake. Oh, yeah. And for unrelated reasons, I would not like to hear part of this song. No, I don't, I don't want to. We're gonna hear it. Okay, I'm gonna we, put my head down then. Oh, it's fine. You okay. can go ahead, Grant. I'm gonna think of the war. <laughs> you fucking for hours. hours. That pussy got power. That pussy got power. Is it over? Yep. Okay. I quite liked it. I got a question. Is pig meat technically groundhog? <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. We were fucking for hours. Let's go to the next one, Grant. <laughs> that it's too soon to forget. Well, that's the Queen of Soul. Aretha? Mm -hmm. That's Aretha Franklin. Aretha Franklin. Detroit! 
Dude, I completely forgot to ask you about this. Hmm. The other day when I was driving, I saw one of those Little Caesars guys out spinning the sign like for the pizza place, and it looked just like you. <laughs> no, it have didn't. You, have you been doing <laughs> no, that? No, it didn't. What the hell? No, it didn't look like, just like me. What are you talking about? Have you been picking up shifts <laughs> as the sign guy at Little Caesars? <laughs> you did not see what you thought you saw. You must have been high or having a common illusion. That was not me, okay? Are you crying? No, I'm not crying. This is, I was what? just wondering if you were spinning a sign at Little Caesars. It's not that big of a deal. No, I'm not crying. Yeah, the $5 hot and ready is not $5 anymore. So what? It's nothing to cry over. They still have great deals. It's still one of the top sign spinning jobs you can get in the industry. <laughs> I mean, it's head and heels above a car wash or something, or like a uh, Metro PCS. The Little Caesars job's like one of the top ones. For sign spinning? Abs yes. You better watch your tone. And anyway, it wasn't me, okay? I didn't know sign spinning was an industry of any kind. I didn't know there's a ranking of sign spinning. Right, now you pissed me off. It was me, motherfucker, and I'm the best goddamn sign spinner on Six Mile. And you let Joey, Bryce, and Angelica, they can get fucked. That's my block. I'm the sign spinner. I invented the triple twirl. And I'm the first one to ever stand on his own sign. I spun it. And I stood right on top of it like a little perch. And it kept spinning. And so did I. And I'm not going to stop. Just because some bigwig from Hollywood. Ah, <laughs> you know what? You struck a nerve, buddy. You just really, really struck a nerve. How about you don't drive around anymore to places you don't need to go? Are Joe, Bryce, and Angelica other sign spinners? <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't... I, you could call them that. <laughs> I don't I care. I'm not invested in the drama of the sign spinning community. I'm just asking. I will fucking end this town. <laughs> oh, I will end it. Joker style. Let me show you a little something. That was, that was pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> Now what? Who's the big dog on Six Mile now? Three, two, one. I put Johnny P's Caddy by Benny the Butcher and J. Cole. I put I Wish by Kodak Black. This is Surround Sound by J.I.D. featuring 21 Savage and Baby Tay. Yes! Oh, okay, okay. I was just trying to go super gremlin. That it's too soon. The fucking pack off of the porch or break a pound down. Yeah, that's yeah. rocks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's our, that's a really, crazy. really good one. That flows crazy. Yeah. DJ Grant, drop that next one. Twist is coming, guys. All right, stay tuned. Oh, yeah. That is nice. That is nice. Yes. Just... I did not know that was a sample. <laughs> What are you laughing at? <laughs> I'm just picturing those squirrels when they make them water ski. <laughs> That's just so sick. You ever seen like a bulldog skateboard? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Why is it always a bulldog? They're like the skaters of the dog yeah. world. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. They seem a little chunky to be skateboarding. It's never a dachshund. Like a Pomeranian seems like the right size. Maybe even a pug. I don't know. Or like when those raccoons ride those little tricycles. <laughs> that is my favorite. I love when a raccoon rides a tricycle. <laughs> How'd they get thumbs, though? I don't know. That seems weird that they got thumbs and everyone else got shafted on thumbs. Yeah, I feel like they're God's second favorite. I kind of snapped with these guys. <laughs> I'm gonna give them thumbs and an insatiable hunger for trash. <laughs> they are gonna love trash and they're gonna be able to pick stuff up. <laughs> Three, two, one. Out of time by the weekend. I put six star wanted level Babytron. It is out of time <laughs> yes. by the weekend. Yes. Uh, it's uh, right as you said it. I played the song at my house the other day. <laughs> yeah, it's a great song. <laughs> it's a great song. Yeah, I love Jim Carrey's thing at the end of it. And just like the song says, you, you are, are out, out of time. time. But I'm out of time. Say I wish I could like go back to prom because of that song. I guess I never went to my original prom, so. Does that work? If I never went to my original, can I go? Like, yeah. It's a voucher? Yeah, as long as you have a voucher. Yeah, <laughs> yeah cool, mm -hmm. I definitely do. Prom voucher, yeah. yeah. Who are you gonna ask? Um, sorry, I know you're busy, but. <laughs> um. Say something! It's literally a vector graphic, like it's not a person. <gasps> she said yes. She did not say anything, she's a cop. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yes, I can't wait to go to prom with you, my new wife. I mean, we'll take it slow. My new girlfriend. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I hate 
ones like this. Ooh, ooh. Is so iconic. This is a Fast and Furious sample. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna watch all those movies tonight. Tonight? Yeah. <laughs> That's gonna be a long, yeah. you're gonna be up all night. Yeah, I got a lot of Adderall, so it should be easy. Right, okay. Yeah. And you get so angry when you take Adderall. <laughs> Fast and Furious, I guess. Yeah. 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 Three, two, one. I put Poppin' by Rico Nasty. I put Work It by Missy Elliott. This is TD by Lil Yachty, Tierra Whack, Tyler the Creator, and ASAP Rock. Oh, what? yeah. Okay, all right. Uh, I swore it was like Missy's era. <laughs> What a flow. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> well, it has come time for our twist. We're gonna start doing this in samples. We might do it in some other games too. For the next four, Dignan and I have chosen samples to play for one another. Mm -hmm. So we've fed them to DJ Grant. He's gonna play them out loud. I'm not gonna guess when mine is playing. Dignan's gonna guess and vice versa. Yes. So there's two possible points for each of us in this section. So DJ Grant's gonna play Dignan's first and I'm gonna guess and then it's gonna be the other way around. Got it. Did you pick it like one of your favorite songs? What was your- I do like the song, but it's just like, it's one of my favorite sample flips. That's what made me think about it. It's just like a really iconic, clean sample flip. All right, you ready, Riley? <sighs> yep. All right, three, two, one. Put Heart of the City by Jay-Z. <sighs> This is Oh Boy by Cameron featuring Jules Santana. Mm. You might not recognize it by title, but play him a little of the track. And Dip I know set. It. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Exactly. All right. Just Blaze. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. It's crazy that I guessed something from the blueprint because right. Just Blaze did half the blueprint. Like yeah. I just, it sounded like something either Ye or Just Blaze would chop up. Absolutely. You know what I mean? But yeah. I just didn't recognize it. Wow. Oh boy. Wow. And that's uh, Rose Royce from the Car Wash soundtrack is the original one. Oh, Working okay. Working at the car wash. Yeah. All right, hit me with Riley's. For my first one, there are two possible answers. Okay. There's probably more, but there's two that I feel like you would know. All right. That both sample this sound. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh man, no bells are ringing. All right, I gotta guess. I don't think it's right. All right, Diggy, you ready? <laughs> yes. Three, two, one. Suede, no worries. This is Numbers on the Board by Pusha T or Buffalo by Tyler the Creator. Mm. Buffalo's where I recognize it from. I would not have gotten the Pusha one, but <laughs> yeah. Well, you gotta hear the Pusha T yes, one. Let's you go. gotta hear it. How you feeling? That's crazy because that sounds like a Tyler beat. You can tell Tyler's a little. He's a like, he's Pusha T yeah, influence. Big, he loves Pusha T. Big time. There's that video of Pusha T performing live and Tyler's in the crowd. Yeah. I think it's South by Southwest. I could be wrong. But people will know what video I'm talking about. And Tyler is rapping every word from the back. He's like getting up on people's shoulders, like rapping every word at Pusha T. That's and hype. And Pusha's like pointing at him like, hell that yeah. That is hype. Yeah. Before we get to the next two, let's tell them a little bit more about our sponsor. Let's do it. That's right, guys. Today's video is brought to you by Manscaped. Splish splash, I was taking a bath, then I noticed I have beautiful balls. <laughs> yeah. Our friends at Manscaped, the global leader in below the waist hygiene, are turning men's shower dreams into a reality with their new ultra premium collection. Manscaped's really helped me with my confidence, Riley. Uh-huh. Before I used to be a scared little man, and now once I've started smelling good and my balls have gotten extra toned, I have all the confidence in the world. And me, I used to just shower in compliments. But nowadays, I shower with water, soap, and the other fine products from Manscaped. Including this cologne-infused body wash that'll make you smell like an absolute golden god. And don't forget your greasy little scalp. The two-in-one shampoo and conditioner here cleanses and nourishes your brain and head all in one step. Riley doesn't stop there. When you hop out of the shower, you can use the aluminum-free deodorant from Manscaped that is also cologne-infused. And me, I got tattoos. Okay, some people don't like them, some people like them, but I got them. Okay, and I got them for life. <laughs> Luckily, Manscaped has a new hydrating body spray that I can spray on the tattoos to make sure that they don't get dry skin and they don't get infected. Yep. 
Oh boy, my lips are chapped. One second now. The Manscaped Ultra Premium Collection comes with a free gift of lip balm. Oh, there's three in here. Let's go. Give me one. Grant, here you go. Give me one. Yep. Hank, there's only three. You don't even have lips. You're a dog. <laughs> oh yeah. It tastes good. Manscaped's Ultra Premium Collection. Your skin, hair, and balls deserve this. And you can save big when you go to manscaped.com and get 20% off plus free shipping when you use code DIGNIN. That's right. Diggy might not care no more, but he do care about his balls and his B.O. Thank you, Manscaped. Hit the description, there's a link down there. Go to manscaped.com, use code DIGNAN at checkout, and you get 20% off plus free shipping. Thank you, Manscaped, for sponsoring today's video. We love ya. The studio's never smelled better. Back to the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And we're back. Oh All right, let's hear the second Diggy Choice sample. So this is the Jackson 5, right? Correct. Okay. Jackson 5. Oh, baby, give me one more chance. Tell me I love you. Okay. All right. So it's just the beginning part? Mm hmm I will say this. I think it's pitched and slowed, too. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Wow, I never noticed right? it. Right? And it, like, blows your brain up when you realize it. Wow. <laughs> oh, my God. I hope you get it right. Three, two, one. Izzo. Jay-Z. It is Izzo by Jay-Z. Yes. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I never noticed. <laughs> Yeah. It was sampled in there Isn't until you crazy? said it was slowed. Yeah. How'd they get that cleared? I don't know, because Kanye made that beat. No, I know. Yeah. Of course. And yeah, I don't understand how they got it cleared either, but. I can't believe Kanye thought to try to sample something so popular right. to then pitch to Jay. Like, I, that just seems crazy to me. <laughs> yeah, He'd exactly. be like, oh yeah, here, clear this, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be fine. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo. But shizzle my nizzle used to dribble down in V8. How weird is it that I guessed another song from the blueprint? I know. <laughs> the other one. I was gonna say something when you guessed that one, but I let it be. It's crazy how like such an iconic song can have such an iconic song baked into it, and then you've known that song for so long and never really picked never up knew. on it. Never knew. But that's like part of what makes it become so iconic. You yeah. Know what I mean, the, the ingredients in there are already great. All right, four to two. Let's get Riley's last selection on Diggy here. Yep, that's the part. Who's that original? Mr. Twin Sister. Mr. Formerly just Twin Sister, but they had to change it, and so they added Mr. So it's Mr. Twin Sister. <laughs> I believe there was another Twin Sister band or something like that, but they had to change it. Weird. <laughs> so when the when Meet the Frownies came out, they were just Twin Sister. All right, you ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Rigor Mortis, Kendrick. This is The Recipe by Kendrick Lamar featuring Dr. Dr. Dre. Dre. Yes, of course. The bonus track off Good Kid, Mad City. Yeah, a mm -hmm. great jam too. Mm -hmm. God dang it, I was close. Yeah, Rigor Mortis is like a crazy jazz sample. Yeah. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> it was just in the ballpark, so I had to guess something. Wow, you got two stumpers on me and you got one of mine. Mm -hmm. Nice, mm -hmm. well played. Yes, hey, there we go. Let's hear a little bit of The Recipe. Every morning when I wake up, oh, money on my mind, go time to get kicked up. Absolute jammer. Yeah, I just, I'm a huge Mr. Twin Sister fan, yeah. and then I love that song, and that's kind of how I discovered Twin Sister, was okay, from yeah. hearing that sample and wondering what it was. Oh, that's cool. So. The magic of the world of samples. Hey, that's why we play this game. Absolutely. Somebody's gonna discover something today that they haven't heard that's an old song, mm -hmm. and go listen to that band, and then maybe that'll become their favorite band. Yeah, like the Jackson 5. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right, back to the ones Grant picked. A field recording vibe to yeah. this one. It sounds like a toy piano, like half mile away. This one's weird, but I think I recognize it. There's gotta be a story here though. Yo, did you hear about the documentary they're doing on Michael Jordan's long lost son? Mm -mm. It's called 23 and Me. <sighs> Three, two, one. Sad. Sad. It is sad by X. Yes. There we go. That is X sampling a BMW i8, which was his favorite car. Oh. Really? It his favorite car. Yeah. So it was like the turn signal or something? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's weird. It's so melodic. I actually love that beat. I don't know how they made that quiet little field recording sound like that. Yeah. You know? It's really cool. It's got such emotion to it. Yeah. yeah. Grant, let's get into the next one. Wow. I don't care who sampled it. That was gas. Uh huh. This is Half Mass by Empire of the Sun. Ah. I got in a lot of trouble for that over the last year or so. What? Being half masked. 
<laughs> Three, two, one. I put Sky Might Fall by Kid Cudi. <laughs> I put Nail Tech by Jack Harlow. This is The Spins by Mac Miller. Oh, okay. That makes a lot more sense than a Jack Harlow song. <laughs> <laughs> See, I knew it was that era. Like, I was yeah. like, it's early Mac or early Kid Cudi. It has to be. Yeah. Wanna get a mansion, a jacuzzi, a theater to watch my movies, couple whips and lots of fancy things. Oh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's hear the next one. All right, this next one is a vocal interpolation. Okay. You went fast asleep. You wouldn't even talk to me. Come in, I'm intoxicated. Oh, I know who does it. I just don't know the track yeah. title. I'm gonna need to look it up. Man, what is the song though? Three, two, one. I put Drake Feel No Ways. Race My Mind. It is Race My Mind by Drake. Uh, make I've, love to me. <laughs> I knew it was newer than this too. Yeah. I was just like, damn, that's my favorite song off the new one. Me too. Yeah. And it's funny because that is a Rick James interpolation and I hear that song being covered by like white guys in dad hats doing little like sing-songy versions of it now <laughs> yeah. all the time. Yeah. Like, yeah. I wanted you to race my mind. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, oh, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I really do love that song. Yeah. That, Drake is really good at that. And just thinking to take Rick James and do like a sultry R&B song mm -hmm. is yeah. a really good idea. Yeah, he is kind of our Rick James. <laughs> Think about that one, kids. Think about it. <laughs> Guys, you want to hear my impression of a really cold Rick Ross? Yeah. <laughs> Maybach music. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. Two days price. Fat Joe. Fat Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday's price is not today's price. You know, I watched that live, live. Oh, really? On Instagram. When Fat Joe went live with Nori and was talking about that, I watched oh, it. Wow. wow. It was right after Drink Champs with Kanye. Yeah. And he's just saying, he's like, price went up. <laughs> Yesterday's price. That's hard. Yeah, he just keeps doing it to Nori. He's hyping Nori up. That's hype. Oh, it was so cool. Three, two, one. Diet Coke. Diet Coke. This is Diet Coke by Pusha T. Yes. Uh, crack open another DC. <laughs> Man, I love this song. Yep. It's grown on me more and more the more I listen to it. You order Diet Coke, that's a joke, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that was another fun game of samples. This is maybe our favorite game to play on this channel. We're gonna keep doing it. So if you have some interesting samples, send them over to DJ Grant. We've got his stuff linked in the description. Uh, before we end, we would like to once again thank our sponsor, Manscaped. Manscaped. <laughs> Check the link in the description. Go to manscaped.com, use code Dignan for 20% off, plus free shipping. Thank you again to Manscaped. And make sure you like the video, subscribe, all the stuff I said at the beginning. And Diggy, would you like to leave these wonderful people with some advice to leave or live their lives by? I sure would. Some people feel the rain, and others just get wet. All right, this has been Hi-Fi TV. We love you, we appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. I love you, Pusha T. I love you, Pusha T. Thanks for watching, Pusha T. Thank you for watching, Pusha T. And Kanye. Is it true that that's really just piss? <laughs> Whoa, wait a minute. Where'd they go? Oh, okay, hey. Get on!